So we're going to take a look at uh, adding some files in, to a shared folder. So a folder that's being shared with you, it's not yours, someone else has uh, sent it to you and they want you to contribute to the folder. Um, this is great again if you're working with students in terms of groups or maybe this is something that you're doing with your departments. Um, so let's take a look. So first things first, let's go to our drive. Once you're in the drive, you'll notice that, uh, again, these are your files and folders that uh, you've created. Um, however, there's a little little section down here underneath my drive called share with me. Anything that's been shared with you, again, goes into this little, little folder. So these are not your files, you just simply have access to them. When it comes to folders, you have access to view any of the content, but when it comes to adding content to a folder, you actually have to add this to your drive. So when you find the folder that you that's been shared with you and that person wants you to contribute to it, adding files or uh, images or whatever it may be, um, you first need to add this to your, your drive. There's a few ways you can do this. First way, very simply and easily, click it and hold and drag up to your drive and you can drag it into the folder or subfolder just by leaving it hovered above the folder. The other way, right click, and you'll see this little icon here, add to my drive. If you click on that, you will add this to your drive. And lastly, up here in the menu bar up top, you also see the icon add to my drive. So if you click on that, you then are given the prompt, where would you like to add it? Where would you like it to move it to? So you can leave it just in your general drive or you can move it into a folder or subfolder by double clicking and going forward. So I'm just gonna move it into this folder move and now it's in the drive. So now when I go to my drive, I go to where I've added it, you'll notice that it's here. You can see that it has a little shared icon as part of the folder who shared it with you. And now because it's a part of this drive, I can drag things into this folder and therefore contribute to the collaboration that's existing. All right, so quick and easy, adding stuff to a shared folder, just make sure you add it to your drive.